Okay guys, so as we are closing out the 7th year anniversary on Global, I really wanted to take a look at the 7th year anniversary special summon. I'm really talking about the friend summons. Now this is, at this point, to my memory and to this day, a global exclusive, very similar to the global tickets, right? That global usually gets with the dual dark confess banners, barring worldwide celebration because that is a joint celebration. But there is a lot of value to be had with the 7th year anniversary premium friend summon. So what I decided to do, uh, I decided to actually do a few summons. I had originally intended to do 50 summons. Uh, after I got to about 30, I was like, nah, this is going to take way too long. So we stopped at 30, but I've documented the results and we'll actually go through and I'll show you guys the amount of rewards that you can get. There's a lot of Zenny to be had. There's a lot of Kai's to be had. And I know in particular, Zenny is always a big issue for players because <laughs> we'll talk about this in a second, but generally speaking, you need a quite a lot of Zenny nowadays to easier your units. So right? just to give you guys an example, uh, a lot of the modern day TURs require around 30.5 million Zenny to easy A from start to finish. And then your LRs are usually around 35 million. So that's a lot of Zenny just on one, one of these units, right? And if we take a look at the 70th anniversary where we literally had, what, like two LRs, uh, three free to play units. We had like four regular TURs and there's still the LR Super Saiyan for Goku and Vegeta easy A to come. So that's almost like 10 easy A's. So I can definitely see why players are short on Zenny all the time. Now, before we actually switch over to the desktop where I've documented my results, I do want to point out that there are actually currently two of these Friend Summon banners right now. The 70th Anniversary Premium Friend Summon banner, which is a multi-summon only format, costs 20,000 Friend Points. And then, of course, we have the regular 70th Anniversary Special Friend Summon, which is just your single summon at 200 Friend Points for a single. And then, of course, the multi is 2,000. But you definitely want to make sure you go for the premium friend summon because this one has higher rates for Hercule statues, Elder Kai's, the Dozing Kai's, and even some of your regular units, right? Like your SRTNs and SR Chouts, which can be very useful when it comes to SA farming. Okay, so we've now moved over to the desktop. And I'll be honest, I don't know the best way to format this just because I also want to show the summons themselves, right? So what I may just do, and this will be for me to decide during editing, is we have all this information on the left. I may just throw the summons on the right hand side of the screen and then we can go from there. So we did a total of 30 multi summons. It felt like I was there for a long time. It felt like I was there for about an hour, but I think it was really only 15, 20 minutes. And so with that, we spent 600,000 friend points. Now, if you are a brand new player, uh, this could be somewhat difficult to achieve, but I think even if you're able to do five, 10, seven, two, three, four multi summons, you also get a decent amount of value from it. So I split this into three categories, units, Kai's and Zenny. So the two units that were of the most importance were LR Hercule and then LR Great Samuel 1 and 2. Coincidentally, both of them have easy A's. Hercule, uh, unfortunately, is not that great anymore. Um, he can still look solid in some of the early-ish game content. I think if if Earthlings uh, get an extreme super battle, he could still be useful, right? Because he does have the 50% chance of evading enemies' attacks for three turns after receiving an attack. And he also... Uh, has a medium chance of stunning, so he has some super uh, super battle road type abilities, but yeah, I don't know, he just doesn't seem uh, that impressive anymore. What would be interesting though is the Int Hercule easy, and remember, because the SR Hercule who drops from the Friend Summon banner is an SR, you can actually raise uh, the SA of any Hercules. Great Summon 1 and 2 are actually pretty good still, uh, they did easy, A. they have a pretty solid leader skill. Uh, you do need to run, of course, all five types, but that's still a pretty sizable buff for a free to play unit. Uh, they seal on their 12 key, raise attack and defense for one turn on both their 12 and 18 key. Also give an attack buff to all superclass allies, have amazing support. Uh, so they can look pretty good still in on in any of these teams as a support unit. So yeah, they're actually pretty good. And I would advise that you get them farmed as a priority from the Friends of Banner. So if we go back, we then move over to Kai. So we, we pulled actually 22 of these 30% Elder Dozing Kai's. Again, I wouldn't really say that they're most useful. Uh, I suppose if you want to do some quick maths, 30% of 22 I believe is roughly around six so assuming that we do get 30 percent of them to work we're looking at six kai's we then got one agl grand kai eight of the tech grand kai's four int grand kai's two str grand kai's and then one sorry not one two physical grand kai's so there's quite a a, a huge weighting towards the tech grand kai's but that's still a, a decent amount of kai's overall right we're looking at what um 12 13 and that's an extra four so 17 kai's there 22 so the total is around 40, but again, you want to you wanna put this with a, an asterisk or a question mark because a 30% chance uh, is always not the most reliable. Okay, and now we can actually move over to the Zenny. So the Zenny is split into four different categories. We have bronze, silver, gold, and platinum. 
Remember, bronze Hercule statues net you, I believe it's 250,000 zenny a piece. Silver gets you 500,000 zenny a piece. Gold is 1 million uh, zenny a piece. And then we have the platinum, which is 1.5 million zenny. So we got four of the bronze getting giving us 1 million zenny. We got 13 silver giving us 6.5 million zenny. We got 23 of the gold giving us 23 million zenny. And then we got 24 of the platinum giving us 36 million zenny. So overall, if we actually just take a look at the total, uh, we essentially got two free to play LRs. Uh, we got 17 SA raises. You want, if you can or if you want to, you can bump that up to 23 because 30% of uh, 22 is roughly six. Uh, so that's pretty solid. And then the Zenny, uh, the total is actually 66.5 million, which is very good because if we actually go back to the browser here, I'll go ahead and show you guys. Remember, regular TURs cost 30.5 million Zenny to Easy A. And then you have your LRs, which is costing 35 million. So uh, essentially, we can easy A uh, two of each type, or I say two of each type, but two TURs or two LRs, or one TUR and one LR with relative ease. And if you also just take a look, I'm not even including the characters that we're able to sell, right? I did sell a lot of the SR Videls, the Pui Puis, the Barbadies, the Tiens, the Chaozus. And so we also accumulated 16 million zenny just from selling all those characters. Again, hopefully I can throw that on the right hand side of the screen uh, just to show you guys. But that one did push our total zenny count up to 82,750,246, which is very good. So, uh, yeah, definitely make sure you go ahead and summon on this special premium uh, friend summon banner, right? Remember, the banner does disappear on the 9th. I'm recording this on the 6th. So you've got around two and a half days. That being said, thank you guys for watching. Let me know uh, what your results were. Let me know if you even want to summon, because uh, I know some people will be put off because of uh, the, the actual the long time that it takes to get through these sums. I wish there was a skip button, man. Like, Dokkan is seven years in. I can't believe we still don't have a skip button. But yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.